Hello, I am Dr. Raghunath Reddy. I am a consultant pulmonology and critical care specialist at Sunshine Hospitals, Sikandarabad. In the last video, I spoke about the introduction of coronavirus and transmission of the virus to humans. Today, I am going to talk about the epidemiological data by WHO and uh, the risk factors involved in getting the coronavirus disease. According to WHO, as on 20th February, about 75,734 patients are infected with the coronavirus disease. Among them, more than 12,000 patients are critically ill and the mortality or the death rate is around 2,128 as on 20th of February 2020. Coming to the Indian statistics, there are only three confirmed cases of coronavirus disease in India, all in the Kerala and they have improved, they have been quarantined, treated and the patients improved and discharged. And uh, there is a Princess Diamond uh, cruise ship which is uh, from Hong Kong to uh, Tokyo. Six Indians are infected on the cruise ship and they are said to be recovering. And coming to the infection rates, the coronavirus disease is a very infectious uh, virus which causes infections at a rate of 2.2 percent RO we measure it in RO that is the number of uh, people the patient of coronavirus disease infects before he gets either cured or dies it is around 2.2 is the initial estimate but later they have known that it is more infectious and now the revised infectious rates are around 4.4 to 6.6% uh, that is before the patient dies or gets cured of the coronavirus disease he infects six another normal patients before he gets cured or before he dies and what are the risk factors or the risk factors of the patients who can get infected the patients who are elderly the patients who have comorbid diseases like hypertension diabetes uh, heart diseases kidney diseases or respiratory diseases like asthma, COPD, they are at risk of developing coronavirus disease from a patient. The another risk factor is uh, patients coming from China, particularly in and around Wuhan city where the epidemic has uh, started. The patients who have come from there are at risk of developing infections and the patients who have visited the Wuhan wet market or the seafood market are at risk of developing uh, the disease. Normal people who have come in contact with the people coming from China, particularly from Wuhan city are also at risk of getting the infection from them. Another risk factor is healthcare workers, the doctors, the paramedical staff taking care of patients infected with COVID virus or the patients having coronavirus disease, they are at risk of getting infection. Sunshine, it's all sunshine.